everybody, it's Ron Seib, and I'm back with an update on the Fujitsu ScanSnap iX500. Now, you remember in my original review, you could scan wirelessly to your iOS device, but you could, or your Android device, but you could not scan to your computer over Wi-Fi. It only allowed you uh, to scan via USB. And there's an update that just came out for the scanner that will now allow you to choose one computer, uh, one computer only, uh, that you can connect to the scanner initially by USB and then disconnect it and scan wirelessly. So I have my uh, MacBook Air here. So we're going to, uh, we already configured the scanner. So we're going to connect to it upstairs and in my home office. And I'm going to go to uh, duplex scan here. So we'll select that. And now it is connecting via Wi-Fi and hopefully <laughs> um, to the scanner that is upstairs in my home office. And it looks like it might have uh, successfully captured the document. Yep, there it is. So I did a little uh, test scan with a, a little Sharpie marker and a piece of paper I had upstairs. Uh, and I can pretty much do whatever I would do with the scanner if it was plugged in, like uh, do some OCR or send it to Evernote or uh, just dump it into a folder uh, that I would do if I had it plugged in via USB. And that's a pretty helpful thing, uh, especially because one of the big complaints that I heard from people that uh, have been following my channel is that it's great that you have Wi-Fi to your iPhone, but what about the computer? So this kind of solves the problem. Now you can change which computer can connect to the scanner wirelessly, but you have to plug uh, the scanner back into the computer, load up the wireless utility, and then run a little swap program uh, that will allow you to swap the wireless token, I guess, from uh, one computer to another. So, uh, you know, it's possible to use more than one computer, but you can't use more than one computer at one time, and they also have to be physically connected uh, to the device at least once to pair up to it. Uh, you can still use multiple mobile devices, so you can use as many iPhones or iPads as you have, provided you uh, use the password that you've assigned the device, but uh, the same cannot be said with computers. It's kind of an odd choice, and maybe uh, they have other enterprise products that have similar functionality and maybe trying to limit it somehow, but uh, it's a bit of a disappointment that you can't uh, get multiple computers going at the same time, but uh, you finally can scan wirelessly with your computer just one at a time. This is Lon Seipen. Thanks for watching.